all set for a match that might well be remembered for a long, long time. At the same token, it might end up something that we don't want to talk about. But who knows? We're a long way from there. Much changed Italian team, as you've been hearing. Eight of those who start tonight didn't start the previous game. We qualified them as group winners, and that's the lineup. But uh, a very experienced lineup it is, too, with plenty of representation from the Italian champions, Juventus. There's the Irish team with those changes that you've heard so much about. Shane Duffy making his competitive debut. He's played once with Richard Kill before that on his debut against Costa Rica and Philadelphia prior to the uh, 2014 World Cup. And the match that will decide Ireland's destiny in this European Championship. Is it to be France on Sunday or is it to be the plane home? Well, that's a poor clearance there by Bonucci. Shane Long trying to combine with Brady. And Bonucci hoops it away, happy to get it anywhere. Italian attack breaks down. Murphy got a little touch. Hendricks come onto this now. Jeff Hendrick seeking a way to go. Oh. What a shot. What a strike is right. He tried nestled in the top corner from where we were. Gets it onto his left and pings it. This cannot be far away. Oh my goodness. Just misses the post. What an effort. Inches keeper and getting nowhere near it. It's not three corners ago. The board has forced the corner. Off Bernadeschi. With Brady with it. Firm header just over. Daryl Murphy, so close to his first goal for Ireland. Great header. It's a good save from the keeper. To the goo. Gets a good hand on it. Probably going to hit the bar and just dip over, but he couldn't take that chance. To the goo. A good header from Murphy. And a second corner for Ireland. Robbie Brady. Handball. Handball. No hand. Handball against Ireland. We've been encouraged at the first 20 minutes. Back again by McCarthy. Hendrick drilled into the danger zone. All oh, this could go anywhere. Shane Long. And it's out. And it's a corner. It did say that Shane Long wasn't in the field of the play. But he's right in front of the goalkeeper. This is a great ball by Ward. And Hendrick does brilliant to get this cross in also. The bobbles about. Just, he just can't control it. He wasn't offside, was he? Brady to cross it. Oh. Just that little too close to the goal for Shane Duffy to be able to turn it in. The other Shane, Shane Long, thinks he's on it. He comes in behind him. You see number nine at the back. And it's whipped in. He's thinking, I might be able to head that in. Coleman's in a lot of room here. First he beats Terenzi. Brady needed to get the shot away first time. That's still to come out to Ward. And hung up by him. Coleman's in there. That's, if that's not panned out, I don't know what is. He cannot go anywhere. His arm is around his neck and then he's trying to head it. I, I don't know. Tichilio. To Mobile. Italy's first shot in the 43rd minute. And that's how quickly it comes about. It's a hopeful ball. McCarthy just can't get his foot to it. And Mobile just wide. McCarthy did well there. Hendrick, we have to do it again. Hendrick, Long, Murphy rather. McLean. And surely that's a penalty. Surely that's a penalty. It's not, you know. Ski on McLean. Yeah, this is the second time the tournament referees have done us wrong. It's all over him. It's a penalty. He's dived straight into the back of him. Referee, you've got to give it. You're right looking at it. He's right beside it. What you need reminding, if it stays like this, it won't be enough for Ireland. 
They need a win to go through. Fischilio. Oh, that was Zaha. And that was close. Yeah, they seem to come out with a little bit more determined second half, the Italians. They seem to be getting a little bit more time on the ball, a little bit more space. The ball's in, Zaza first time volley. Just over the top. Kyo to give somebody a chance to run after. It's Daryl Murphy. Murphy. Senegal saves. Oh, a chance here. Coleman. They've just got the body in the way. Kyo first in. What a chance for Coleman. He hits up Bob Bonner with the ball, really. He should have scored. Scuffed it into the ground. Good chance. Now the chance to introduce Wes Houlihan in place of James McCarthy. Long enough uh, for more than a cameo from Wes Houlihan. 15 minutes. Uh, McCarthy played better than he's played in the opening two matches for sure. But now it's up to Houlihan to try and open this Italian defence. But this is a senior. And senior with a shot off the post. Damian wins the throw. Said he was quick, sharp, compact, gets away from tackles, hits the post. So close. McGeady, no foul, no foul given. Chance here for Hullahan. Let's Hullahan save. And saved again. Goodness gracious, was that not? Chance. That is the chance. Oh, he couldn't have got a better chance. He's took so much time to hit it. Oh, what a chance. What a chance that was. Well, is that it? Have we seen the moment pass? But it might have happened. Let's hope not. Houlihan. Inviting his there! Robbie Brady brings us all to our feet in Rio. No more than Ireland deserved. A fantastic goal to put Ireland in front. Now, just six minutes remain. And Leo sees Leon on the horizon. He certainly made up for missing that chance with a glorious ball. He's just gone and attack it. He drops off. I'm thinking you should run into the corner. He drops off, looks up. Whips a great ball in. Keeper can't call. Didn't know what to do. And a great, great header. Gets there before the keeper. It's normally his cultured feet delivering inch perfect set pieces. But on this occasion, it's the foreigner Ronnie Brady that puts Ireland in front. Absolute delirium and delight in Lille. The additional minutes are up. The Italian manager has as good as conceded defeat. If they just keep the ball down there, that will surely be sufficient. There is the whistle. It's one of those nights. Ireland, for the first time ever, are in the last 16 at the European Championship. It's Stuttgart. It's New Jersey. They're all rolled into one. Another big, big scalp when it was needed most and Martin O'Neill has done it again final score Italy nil Republic of Ireland won Lyon here we come Robbie Brady congratulations what a moment for you and what a moment for Ireland what a moment for everyone involved we said it that we we're going to do a job for everyone that came out here today and, and we did it we made history into the next 16 and we go again tell me about the goal I don't know he legs my body started to carry my legs into the box and just trusting ways to put it put it where, where, where it hurts and, and I've managed to get my head on it so I'm lost for words really, I'm, I'm over the moon, emotional, it's, it's, it's unbelievable. It really is unbelievable and there it is in writing, confirmation of Group E. Italy top the group, they'll go on to play Spain on Monday, Belgium finish runner-up in the group, they'll play Hungary on Sunday and Ireland beating Italy tonight secures third place and means we will play France on Sunday 
at 2 p.m. in Lyon.